This is Diododo Diodio constituency. It is one of the busiest parts of the Greater Accra region due to the numerous commercial activities that take place here by settlers from across the country. With a total population of over 180,000 and a voter population of about 110,000 as at 2016, the constituency serves as a hub for corporate entities such as the Central Bank, the General Post Office, APSA Bank Head Office, the former AMA Head Office, among others. The constituency shares borders with the Ablekuma South, Central and Kole constituencies. Notable communities within it are Bukum, Jamestown, Old Fadama, Palladium, Adedenko and Gamashi. Within the same constituency are the famous Mokola, Agbogloshi, Kantamanto and Konkombayam markets. It has several electoral areas which include Mulichagono, Ngleshi, Amamumu, Koledudo, Kikan and Mudo. In terms of governance structure, the Ododododio constituency seat has mostly been won by the National Democratic Congress NDC since 1992. However, in the year 2000, Reginald Nibi Ayubonte of the NPP grabbed the seat from the NDC with 51% of the votes in that election. In 2012, Edwin Nilante Van der Poy won the seat for the NDC and has since retained the seat for the NDC. Based on the aforementioned figures, the Ododododio constituency is settling for either the NDC or the NPP. Contesting the 2020 elections on the ticket of the NPP and NDC are Neil Ante Bannerman, who is currently the Executive Secretary of the Premix Fuel Committee, and Neil Ante Van der Poy. The contest is not going to be an easy one, as the two-time representative of the NPP would have to face it off with the current MP for the National Democratic Congress, Neil Ante Van der Poy, who has served the constituency as an MP since 2012. The constituency has, over the period, recorded pockets of violence prior to elections. In January 2020, the NP Nilante Van der Poy alleged of an assault on him by some national security personnel, which led to a clash between supporters of the NPP and NDC in front of the Jamestown Police Station. In September, the NP again alleged of an attack on him at the Jamestown Police Station by some youth. An NDC agent in the constituency was also allegedly attacked by some persons believed to be members of the NPP during the voter registration exercise in the constituency. Ahead of the 2020 general elections, the Ghana Police Service has again described the constituency as one of its flashpoints.